Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. We're gonna have more fun today, I think. We're gonna, just another silly video, really. I'm sure you have seen these pedals before in your travels, but basically these are mini practice amps, and I thought I'd rip them out and make some kind of weird stereo rig going on with some ping pong delays, some big reverbs, and I just wanna see how how bad it sounds in a way, but you never know. It might sound pretty cool and unique. This is a Fender Mini Twin Amp. A really cool looking amp, actually. It's just a Mini Tweed Amp. Uh, I really like Tweed Amps. And then this is a Dan Electro Honeytone. Um, these are really classic. Uh, this has seen better days, but surprisingly, again, both still work. Hopefully, I'm gonna be able to mic them up so you're gonna hear them left and right if you're watching this with headphones. And it's just gonna be, we're just gonna have some fun. Um, gonna get some ping pong delays, like I said, from the Empress Echo system, and big reverbs with the Hall of Fame too. And, you know, maybe we'll put some fuzz into these. I'm pretty sure they're already pretty fuzzy. Um, but again, we're just gonna have some fun. You know, that's what we're here for. So got, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video and enjoy some sweet, sweet stereo tones. Cheers, guys. This is Really cool. I'm really enjoying the sound. I just had a little go with headphones on with uh, them panned hard left and right and it sounds pretty cool. Uh, you know the, the ping pong delay, one's doing a dotted eighth and one's doing a quarter note delay and then a bit of reverb. It sounds nice. You know in the cans having it, it just sounds good. So I'll show you the setup here because it's a pretty crazy little setup. Let's get the my phone recording and then let's clap so uh, as you can see laptop but here's the good stuff um, here's my pedal board obviously and I'm running the two amps off my pedal board power supply um, which is why it all looks a bit funny um, micing both amps up with SE Electronics condenser mics um, into my audio interface here and then, as you can see, we're recording on Logic. And uh, yeah, the panned hard left and right, like I said. I believe the Fender is hard left and the Down Electro is hard right. Um, that's it, I mean, we're going, we're coming out of the Empress Echo System stereo into the uh, Hall of Fame 2 stereo and then out into the two amps. Yeah, so it's a really cool sound. I'll give you the dry sound. So this is both amps. Um, this is what it sounds like. Okay, and then here's the Fender on its own. And here's the Dan Electro on its own. So as you can tell, neither amps is gonna win any prizes for best tone in the world. It's got a thing, it's got a thing. So let's start out with some reverb. Let's start out with a little bit of reverb from the TC Hall of Fame 2. This is just a little spring reverb. Um, sounds like this. Let's jump up the nut, jump it up a little bit, and add a more uh, kind of detailed reverb going on here, and a bit more level and stuff. And let's just there's a different reverb for you guys.
Nice. Uh, it's a, it's a sound. I mean, it's cool. You know, for what it is, that they're taking that reverb pretty well. I would say you could, the trail seems reasonably clear. The trail seems clearer than the actual guitar playing. Um, moved it back to a more simple spring reverb. Now let's add a little simple analog delay. Um, let's see how it takes it. So this delay is not stereo, it's just going the same thing to both amps. Let's add a little vibrato from the Walrus Julia. Just to, I'm just riffing out here, I'm really enjoying it. Let's step it up a little bit. Let's send a different delay to each amp. Uh, we're going to do that with the Empress Echo System, of course. And you should hear that there's a dotted eighth going to the Fender, I think, and a quarter note delay, standard quarter note, going to the Dan Electro. And let's see what kind of sounds we get. fun I might, I might have to get another one of these and uh, make a stereo rig i've never actually played with a stereo rig big or small before in my life i've always just gone mono straight into one amp but this is really kind of cool it's freaking me out a little bit um let's add a little bit of reverb to that uh let's go big reverb style um so i'm just trying to make it as busy as possible and try and test these amp a little bit and see what happens we will eventually throw some fuzz on i think and that'll that might be the part where we need to end this I'm loving it. I'm really loving it. Now let's let's test the waters a little bit. I'm going to throw on a fuzz pedal. Um, I think this might be the end of the video after I've done this. Let's see. I'm this is the Thorpey veteran. Um, let's try it without all the delay and stuff first. <laughs> Let's throw 
throw the delay and reverb back on and then let's just This is a lot of fun. Um, yeah, this kind of sparked my interest to making a proper stereo rig or a wet dry rig or half stereo, half wet drive. I had a few ideas going on. Um, but yeah, this is really cool. This is, like I said, really got me into the idea of having a dual amp setup. Um, we shall see what comes in the future. But this is fun. This has been a cool, fun little video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed just a little something silly. A little something fun and maybe it sounded all right in the cans maybe uh, I'd recommend listening to on some speakers or some headphones so you can hear it left and right going on about um, but yeah bit of fun and that is a video making the craziest set stereo setup with the Fender mini twin amp and the Dan Electro Honeytone um, cheers guys for sticking around and please subscribe and I'll see you in the next video cheers guys